Good morning and welcome to the Weathers Channel Morning Live. My name is Autumn. This is my husband, Richard. We go live here on our YouTube channel every Sunday morning at 9.30 a.m. Eastern. You can also catch us on our other channel, Watch Autumn Keto, where we go live every Wednesday evening at 8.30 p.m. Eastern for hashtag Hawaka Wednesday. I love everything you just said. Thank you. Um, there perfect. is quite the conversation happening in the chat already. Um, what do you mean? I don't know. I mean, look, there's what, a lot what, of messages. What for do you People's mean? is going back and forth. I haven't got to read it yet, but I'm like, God, that's a lot of comments. So I feel like there's a conversation happening betwixt y'all, but I'm going to see uh, where I need to get in and fit in. Gigi's here. It says, good morning. Well, there's once the forecast. It is sunny. It is good cold, morning, Gigi. but that sun is out. So you know I'm in a good mood. So oh, yep. mom's here. That, that says, good morning, whack family. Uh, Hoofnets here says, good morning, sunny weathers. And good sunny weathers morning, chasers. The sun is shining and we'll be close to 60 today. I know, right? I think we're in, in the 50s, the mid 50s. Yeah, I right know it's so. only February, uh, but I'm happy with the signs that spring is around the corner. Yeah, but somebody yeah, I work I with, she was like, if it's this warm in February, just imagine June through August. You know, like that's why she's Ooh. just like, if it's already hot, that means it's, or, you know, warm, mm. that means it's about to be cray. Well, that's what I always um, remember. You know, when, at that anytime time. you wish for the other season, yeah. It's like, Jen's here. Hits, says, like, good Man. morning from Chile, Draper, Utah. Yay. Absolutely. We, I saw your pictures on the uh, internet. We, we both and I was, did. Yeah, and I was just like, you go, girl. Jen, you I love that. Product. Exactly. I love that keto chow sign. Like, that just, it's, that's just like, I feel like it's a milestone uh, in your keto experience yep, to take yep. a pic picture in front of that sign. Just don't Brenda's take it, here. Take it home says, with good you. morning. They need that. They exactly. Need that so let's. It is one of those cool things you'd have like on your on your back wall or something. Jen said it's been a wonderful trip, and I still have a day with friends here to enjoy. And Yay. isn't Salt Lake City beautiful? Just like out of your eyes, like that's yeah. that's what I was most amazed yeah. by. Like one of so, those postcards. Yeah. So. Like, for me. Yeah. See, look, exactly. Jen said it's amazing. The mountains are just all around you and beautiful, and you look and they're like right there. Exactly. You're just like, oh said. my god, like you can just reach out and grab them. It's I keep crazy. Thinking, like, like, one of them's gonna wake up and be like, hey, you. Yes. Also, keto chow like, oh, is amazing. Hey, that Absolutely. Talking to me. Yes, it is. Um. So no, it's yeah. beautiful. It's like one of that little cartoon. Kelly's here. Says, good cartoon. morning. Yeah, it's beautiful. So. Yeah, I am. Yeah, yeah I'm. I mean, we have we're in a valley, so we have mountains s, but so many trees in between. Those are hills. You can't see. Yeah, like those. Like yeah, we, they're, we they're have not, rolling. Not yeah, we have rolling hills in yeah, Kentucky, which people a lot of people still aren't used to. Like people that might come from Florida mm -hmm. or like whenever they drive through here. If mm -hmm. you're from if you're from Kentucky and Tennessee, you don't see some rolling hills, mm -hmm. right? But some people still have. Well, that's how the West them. is as well. Like, yeah, but them the mountains and plateaus, yeah, like yeah see, flat, yeah. No, that's how. Uh, yeah. My buddy Nick and Austin, they were like, when we got here, it was like, what the heck? So oh, many this trees elevation, came. yeah. Like in Arizona, you can see the other Stand side of the city. Stand in 360, yeah, yep. You mm -hmm. can literally see the other side of the town. Mary T oh. said, good morning to all the weathers and all the wacky weather watchers. How is everyone on this Monday? I'm doing good. B16 here says, good morning. Sam Banner's here. Hey, says, hello, people. Just like Brianna's the game's here. back together. Says, Happy Sunday, so, whack fam. Oh, yes. Hello. The game's um, all here. Oh, Jen said, thanks for always bringing this together. We appreciate it. <laughs> Thank oh you so God. much for the kind words. <laughs> That's Draper, Utah talking. I know, right? That's you're just, Utah. you're just high on life because your scenery is so pretty. So, mm -hmm. Brianna that, said, we barely had snow this year, but it always snows in March. Jeez Louise. We've mm -hmm. had a good amount of snow already. This no, this is what my so. mother calls pneumonia weather. Yes. So. Like everybody's so anxious to be summer. You said I would do the smackdown on the person down. complaining about Jude. Actually, when it's this warm now, my mind goes to the huge Snowzilla that will have happened before Jude. Yeah, people think we're mm. out. No, we're still heading. Oh, we're still heading yeah. back we in. Like, we're more. not climbing we our way out. More. So this yet the time of year where people just think it's summer already. Yeah. It's like shorts. Yeah, it's we like, saw oh, somebody running down. in shorts slow today. Joyce is here. Says good morning, my amazing whack fam and family. Tables fine weather's prayers needed. Going through a rough patch right now. Oh, we're definitely praying for you, Joyce. Right, Dag. Yeah, you're hoping you're hoping you're doing better. Sending the well wishes mm -hmm. through the screen. Um, Jim and Sheila are here says good morning, Autumn Richard, my whack fam. Hi, Sheila. How are you doing? Hey, Sheila. Yeah, Mary T said the this mountain girl always loves to see someone discover actual mountains. Yeah, I I had not seen mm -hmm. actual mountains until like being in Salt Lake. I'm mm -hmm. just like, 
Oh, it was, it wow. Was unique. Like, yeah. Well, I mean, I look at like mountains. Some people like, have never seen the ocean. Yeah, Some exactly. Some people have never, like, there's certain things you just yeah. need to go see. Yeah. You know what I mean? Yeah, like, and that's crazy. I'm just saying. Dee's here. So the morning. The, the world is a beautiful place. Getting weather is a work, fam. Happy Sunday. Ear hustle while feed the kitties. We bet you are. Yay. We bet you, you know, are. If not, so, they're to feed themselves. Yes. Well, that's what I um, Brianna said, when I went to Colorado, I was weirded out how, by how flat it is. And then all of a sudden, mountains. Yeah. I mean, there's. And like the depth perception is oh, the yeah. craziest thing. It literally looks like you could just touch, like hug the mountains. Like it's like a five minute drive. Yeah, like a five it's minute like, drive. But I'll then, be there. yeah, like I'll be, I could be at the base of that mountain in five minutes. It's like no, that's like an hour. Like it's like an hour away. Like trying to get to oh, at yeah. where that mountain. That's a beautiful thing. It feels like as you keep getting closer to the mountain, the mountain keeps moving like it's just like further people like wait a minute i'm driving right to you you know it yeah, was so absolutely so amazing optical illusions. yeah it was and that's yeah that was the most amazing part about it like when we we went to the hotel room we opened the window we we're like ah like mountain like just literally right there but then as we were driving you could tell like oh this is further away than we think like but it was yeah, abs so it was absolutely amazing yeah, so, so no it really is yeah quite, quite beautiful picturesque picturesque we went to the gym this morning it was awesome mm -hmm. we were with mom it was pretty great yeah. we were yeah, on this have your, yeah you two have your little um routine shindig yeah we were on the elbow. smith machine um and it was great we did squats we did uh deadlifts and then we did like chest and upper body too and then we yeah, did some push-ups so we're going to be feeling that all up in her. Also, we did some tricep push-ups too. So yeah, there's so many things. Yeah, I'm, I'm loving impressed. our gym a routine. Very so impressed. yeah. Um, Sam Banner says, I wake up every day in the mountains of a small town, in a small town. That's a, that's amazing. Yay. That's beautiful. Picturesque. So wake up AM. in the mountains. Yeah. <clears throat> yeah. How's your cell service? Um, so Spotty. the title of today's video is listening to audiobooks because mm -hmm. that's what I've just been doing. So you did that today. Uh, yeah, like when I was in the shower, yes. I listened to music, nice. not at the gym, but oh, listen, okay. but like I also listen to audiobooks mm -hmm. on the way to work. That's so cool. Yeah. So whenever I have to go into the office, I used to listen to music. Um, but now I can. I just started to listen to audiobooks because I bought a ton of audiobooks from Audible last year because I had like twelve credits. Don't get me wrong. I paid for them 12 credits. Like, do you want to pay for the annual plan? Like a sucker. I was just like, sure. And then I was just like, oh my God, so many credits. So I spent all the credits and then like I canceled my annual plan because the books are just backing up. Like I don't yeah, listen to them. Think? So I'm like, I'm not keeping the, I'm not paying to keep adding credits when I haven't listened to the ones that I already have. So I bought um, a bunch of them. I've had a few for years, but now I'm also listening to, I'm trying to just go through them, not really chronologically, but just in the just order a, that I want. Yeah. A, whatever you, whatever feels. Yeah. So the first one, so the first one that I listened to and I'm done with it already. Mm -hmm. And this only because it was two hours. This is more of a pamphlet mm -hmm. um, is the four agreements. And mm -hmm. I really liked that book um, because it was, it was like self-help. I think it's a very good um, intro into the personal development world of like freeing your mind. Like I, my mind is already liberated in terms of living without fear and understanding mm -hmm. that you get to choose your reality yeah, and how you feel. Grab the bull by the horn. You know, like don't be brought down by what other people think. Right. You get to, you can choose to be happy right now. Don't judge other people. Don't yeah. judge yourself. Don't let other people judge you. I'm like, I already know. Y'all know that I'm free in that way already. So you know, you dictate the terms of life. Yeah, exactly. So you get to choose. This is how I'm. So live. you know, when I was listening to that book, I was just like, yes, that's a great way to explain it. Yes, all right. What and then I was, you? I was also like, yep, yeah, don't do that. Don't do that. Because he was like, most of us are sad. Most of us care what other people think. Most of us, that's that's called living in hell. I was like, you're right. I was like. That's why you don't do uh, yeah, it. Yeah, the subconscious you know? is a strong. Yeah, thing you too. know, and so even if you fight, then you still might be doing it. Yeah, you exactly. Don't even know it. But then I also had a couple of revelations. Uh, I still had a couple of revelations. Like you know what? That's you, I could still take it further there. So mm -hmm. like the and it was only two hours. It's only a two hour listen. Um, That's and amazing. so yeah, I already listened I to that. that. Uh, and then now I'm listening to Get Good with Money. Because once again, I think I'm pretty decent with money, but we can always be better, right? So this one's like a 10, 8 to 10 hour one. So I got some time before I am listening to or, you know, probably done with that. I just started this girl. She she was like 25. Mm -hmm. She had $40,000 in savings. She um, had a condo and she had zero credit card debt. 
Long story short, she got scammed by this guy because she wanted to learn how to start investing. Mm -hmm. He told her, well, you can just, because he looked rich, had had cars and money, had a condo. He's like, well, you can just invest in my companies. Yeah. Um, and I and, make a re in return. In return, $2,000 two, $2, yeah, a week, exactly. you know? And so he was just like, but the best thing is, you know, don't invest with your money, invest with other people's money. So he then got this girl to open up a credit card and take out twenty thousand dollars in cash advances. Sure they say you and then gave the him the same the same account number. Uh, you know, no, like she, she took the cash, she applied for the credit cards, took the money, and then gave it to him. Makes sense. And I was just like, ah. And she was like, I know as you're listening to this, you're probably like, ah. <laughs> it's like yes. So either way, she got scammed. Well, at least um, they can afford one of his then, cars. And then in addition to that, she also like I got these credit cards. She also signed up for one of those like business um, courses, like one of her business mentors was like, learn how to start your own business for fifteen thousand mm -hmm. dollars swipe out of pocket. Like so thirty five thousand dollars I mean, in, in, in the, nice. over the course of a week. She said when she was at the bank trying to get the cash advance, they literally made her stay there for hours and like answer interview questions like. You're not taking, you know, you, you're taking this money out under your own will. She was like, yeah, I got it. It's an investment opportunity. <sighs> and this was in 2006, I think. So basically I'm just listening to, I'm listening. That's amazing. Man. You know, so she is the the woman that wrote it. She is like the budget Nista. That's her name. Like that's her business now. If you are like, oh, I heard of that girl. Like this is the book I'm listening to. So now we're starting with like her origin story, I love how she became that That's way. That's amazing. So, they didn't do a movie. Yeah. So I'm, I'm just at the first 10 minutes where she just got scammed for $35,000. So <laughs> yeah, um, I'm just, Draven Wetz is here. So good morning, so Mark, um, in including uh, Alexander. Exactly. So oh. well, he's laying down right now. Yeah, he's, yeah, he's very good bud. Good buddy. Good. Jim and Sheila says, smash that like button. You're right. Thank you so much. Hey, Jeno. Yeah. So and Jim Hook just said, Brian got me to try audiobooks. I love to touch a book, but I gave it a try since it's a series. I'm in the middle of book seven of real reading, but um book book twelve and audible. <laughs> I think that's confusing. Yeah. You can't do that. I mean, I'm that same way, Huffman. Um, I'm more of a tactile reader. Like, yeah. I need to feel the. Jen pages. said, I love the Four Agreements basic info, but profound. That's literally the best way to sum it up. Basic info, but profound. You gave us all nice cliff notes. Though. Yeah. And, you know, here's the thing I'm still reading. Like, I have Atomic Habits mm -hmm. on my nightside table. I honestly haven't picked it up in a couple of weeks, but, like, I do, like, you know, like to read when I'm looking for something to do before bed and I'm like not tired, but I'll kind of want to wind down. So reading is that, but basically when it comes down to it, I'm forced to be in the car to go to work. So it's built in like listening audio book time. That so that's sense. what I do. Joy said heading into church for you all have a fantabulous oh, fine day. Same right to you. To yeah. Joyce. Same to you, Joy. So Susan B16 said, I love audiobooks, especially when I'm driving. Yeah, it's it's good I mean, for me. Like, don't get me wrong. Turning, you're making you a convert. I love listening to music, but I listen to music so many other places in my life that I could be listening to an audiobook while I'm driving. So like I listen to music when I'm making mm -hmm. shirts. I'm listening to music when I'm cleaning the house. I listen to music when I'm at the gym. I listen to music like I don't those are the places where I like listening to music. I don't like listening to podcasts or any other thing. So I listen to music so many other places. I can do audiobooks while I drive. That's awesome. Yeah, so yeah. that's what I've been working on. Look at so, you. Yeah, I exactly. Love it. So, um, also one thing that I'm doing now when I'm taking my plane trips is I have a list in my phone of artists. And here's what I want you to think about: coming. You know, let me know in the comments. Think of an artist that you say that you love, but you've never heard their entire discography. Like for me, huge ones: Michael Jackson. I've never heard, I've never literally sat through every Michael Jackson mm -hmm. album or like listened to it, mm -hmm. made a point. We all know the singles, we all know the hits. New edition, I've never listened to every single one of their releases. And so another one that I came across was Britney Spears. As much as I love Britney mm -hmm. Spears, I, 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 I listened to Hit yeah. Me Baby one more time, but there were some other ones in the middle What's of that? there that I didn't listen to. And I picked, I got yeah. around around Blackout, you know, with so, that being said, I don't think I've ever listened to anybody's entire design. Yeah, like Babyface. Or the thing, you know, like you well, hear yeah. their big hits. And so I, I mean, Taylor Swift. Especially the I older love Taylor we get, Swift. the more I'm just and I'm, so I miss the last two CDs you've made. Ex no matter who you no are. Matter, exactly. <laughs> so I'm making it a point to go back and listen to discographies of people that I've written down. Let me see. Yeah. So I've started Britney Spears. Right now I'm so I'm into blackout and I've I've 
Blackout was like, oh, I actually listened to this when it came out and I love it. But like, I didn't listen to Femme Fatale. I didn't listen to so many other ones. Yes. Um, but what did you name I made it through the beginning. Yeah. And so let me see. Art, the artist, the discographies. Oh, I haven't listened to all of Justin Bieber, Michael Jackson, Britney Spears, Mandy Moore, what is Tevin happening? Campbell, Taylor Swift, Jesse McCartney, Janet Jackson, Ralph Tresvan, although I think that's only one or two CDs, TLC, uh, Neo, oh, and New Edition. Say everybody. Well, but these are artists that like I want to make it a point to oh, okay. intentionally go back okay, and well, listen to. Okay, let me reverse the question. Have you ever heard a whole discography from anybody? Well, so In Sync only had three albums. Okay. I've listened to that. Okay. Um, I actually, I sh uh, right now I need to add Backstreet Boys because I have not added Justin is In Sync, or do you keep it going? Or? So you're right. I haven't. I listened to Justified, um, twenty twenty. Mm -hmm. I haven't listened I mean, to like man. I think I listened to Man person. of the Woods, but that's what I'm just saying. Like there are, I need to write there them down lots. too. Yeah. Yes, I'm not going down this rabbit hole. Backstreet Boys, and then I need to do Justin Timberlake because oh, wow. I do want to listen to that. You and even so if it's crazy. once, so my um, my goal or like I'll consider it done when I listen to the discography mm -hmm. three times. Like I can't just hear it once. I like and really make an informed opinion so about wait, it. Now you got to triple up. Yeah. Lord Jesus. I, yeah. I mean that's just the way. That's I just mean, the way you know. that um. I, cause when I hear a song, I'm like, ah, this is corny. And then I go back and listen to it. Like, you know what? Okay, I actually kind of, I kind of like this. Yeah. So, but I, so I have to, no, I have to get over that. my first initial impression. And so at least yeah. twice, usually three times. See, I think that most music to most people is very personal. Yeah. You know what I mean? Like somebody's hot banger could be somebody's dud just um, because at that time in their life, that's what they needed to hear the most was like certain songs, certain yeah. artists just resonate with different people. So yes. like I'm all over the place. Yeah, like and so that's the thing. Everything. But if I like, if I truly say I love an artist, mm -hmm. like how is Michael Jackson my favorite artist of all time? But I've never listened to every single like, like I know, but so I owe it. I, I owe it. it. Jen said, "Oh shirts, I need to get those from you." Yep, I got them all done. Look, if Yay. you're gonna be at the Ohio meetup, I'm pretty sure this past, um, I'm pretty sure this past Friday was your last day to order a shirt. But maybe if you order it on Monday, it'll be available for for Jen to bring it up to you. Aww, but yeah, so, so but yeah, I have all, them already. You all are amazing. Huffy said, I've also started listening to Audible, uh, even for my short trips across town. OMG, Brian tried getting me to listen to Atomic Habits on the way to Kitapalooza. He liked it. I, re I like reading, reading it. it. Right? Like, I do think that reading it you is still good. Reading it? I mean, like I said, I haven't picked it up in two weeks. Okay. But I mean, I have my, my place marked. Well, I do plan on picking you're, it back you're, up. You're an Audible now. Yeah. Um, speaking of that, speaking of shirts, going back to shirts, also the low carb cruise shirts are on the Keto Strong website as well. So I saw Yay. Debbie posted it in the group. I've been answering some comments, but if you want to order some shirts, those are also available. So Yay. Sam Benner said, I personally do better listening to stories. I feel like I comprehend the information that way. Yeah. yeah. So my reading well, comprehension, your imagination just closed yeah, your my reading imagine. comprehension is not where I want it to be. Like if left up to me, simply reading something is not the best way for me to understand it. The best way for it to understand it is actually to have someone instruct me. So Ooh. like if someone is teaching, that's why I did so well in school because I learned very well listening to the teachers. And that's why I never had to study because it wouldn't have helped me. Mm -hmm. Like going independently and reading chapters of a science book that's not how I learned. Well, like, yeah, that sounds boring as crap. But I mean, that's what people did in college. They were like, I, I had know. like a 15 hour library in the day, cram session. That is how we had to learn. There were no computers. And no, but no you, pads. but see, they went to class, is all I'm saying. Like, oh, yeah. they never oh, yeah. went to class. Like, yeah. I went no. to class, so I didn't have to study outside of class. I need all the above. No, yeah. I so, need notes, teacher. No, so study I learned, school, yeah, and... I learned everything that I need to learn in yeah. class I and know taking those notes. But just, if I'm seeing new information yeah. for the first time, reading it is yeah. not the best. No, I've seen people who can literally live on just the notes, people yeah. who literally need the book, and then yeah. people who don't even have to come to class. Yeah. Mary T <laughs> said, my office is so quiet. I, I listen to podcasts. I should try audiobooks. I mean, I feel like they're the same thing. I feel like audiobooks are like movies, yeah. and podcasts are like TV shows. They're like episodic, yeah, you know, but it like it's, on it's your the vibe. same thing. Depends on what you're feeling. Right honestly, I don't think there's any artist that I've listened to every single song. I've heard a lot, but not all. I mean, so that's, that's how what I'm I am, saying. Make it a point. Like, these are the people that I'm, oh I'm making it a point. Hook okay. said, I listen to a lot of crime podcasts. Should I be concerned that I find myself thinking, uh, oh, come on, everyone knows that's not how to hide a body? Yeah, was that only murders in the building where I was just like, they all knew that when you bury a body, you're supposed to do it vertically? Like, 
instead of horizontally. Like most people think you dig like a horizontal mm -hmm. grave, the person's laying down. You actually dig a really deep hole and you just drop the body vertically down in there. And that's the, the best way. I, I think animals can't smell it. I think you dig it deeper, like the hole's actually deeper, so it's harder to find. Like that, I heard that well, somewhere. I, was say. I don't, listen to, is be I don't you know. listen to crime podcasts. I watch people that listen to crime uh, yeah, podcasts. Yeah, yeah. So yeah. yeah. Um that's a good way to driven was that I well, just got also. exactly I just got the Apple Music trial with Verizon six months free. So uh, why not? When we drive to Texas for the low carb cruise, it'll be awesome. I had it playing on my Apple TV. While reading last night, very cool. Yeah, oh, I mean, you, I love that all the music. Amazing. I still have a Pandora cool. subscription. So, Me too. um, oh my gosh, D said, "Don't sleep on Britney Spears." Email my heart, cheesy sounding now, but took uh me through it. Uh, a bad breakup. I yeah. literally said they they let this girl have a song. Say, email my heart. Like I was, it, it's just so funny listening to the early two thousands, yeah. um, of just the, the technology yeah. that was becoming so See? new. Also, the progression of an artist. Like, honestly, I haven't listened to Beyonce's music, but, you know, Britney Spears was like, I love you, we're in high school. And yeah. then, like, in the second one, she's trying to be, like, kind of little, like, naughty, yeah. like, ooh, like, oh, you know, like, know. just is growing up. And then by the third and fourth one, she was like, I'm out here naked in these streets, come try me, you know, like, essentially. Okay. And so I'm just, like, it's so funny to listen to, like, the innocence, yeah. like, evolve well, again, as she gets like older. Like she said, like, it's a part of, about personally, to your life. Yeah. Like, for me, for my bad breaking up, it yeah. happened happened to be when Neo got released yeah. with the whole song about breakups. Yeah. I forget, what was this time? And I'm so sick yeah, of Yeah, like literally when that song. came out, I was like, so is that for me? Tired of did, he, did he do that for me? Yeah. Me? Oh, album? so there's an artist I've listened to her complete discography. Mm -hmm. It's only three albums. Uh, her name's Betty Who. Mm -hmm. I love her. And that kind of happened. <laughs> there was I was listening to her, like I was listening to her uh, album. And I could just like sing all these breakup songs and it didn't matter. But then I was dating somebody and then we broke up. Mm -hmm. And then I'm listening to the songs and I'm like, I'm in my bed, sleeping in your t shirt, and I'm sad. And I was like, dang, I can't listen to this right now. Because <laughs> before then, I was like, I'm in my bed. And I was like, nope. Oh, like, yeah. It, it hit different yeah, when, like, when, when you're involved. When the twins change yeah, a little yeah. bit. That's, I think it, that's how all of us are. Like, yeah. When we're, when we're young, said, I need just, to order shirts for the cruise. I mean, don't get me wrong. songs we don't know what the meaning You got about. time, right? Like, I'm not even, even people that are getting them shipped. I'm not shipping them till May. But, you know, just know that they out there. Mm -hmm. They're so cute. Brian is here. This is great. Good morning, y'all. What a beautiful day. All of the better starting off with you beautiful people. He's talking Aww. about me. Hope everyone is able to enjoy your day and spend it doing something you love. Let's talk to y'all. Tip the cap. Absolutely. Mm -hmm. It's going to be a family day for us. Yes, exactly. We are going to see Richard's siblings. Oh, here, honey. What you doing, bud? You want to you wanna take sit down? Yeah, yeah, he's sitting down. You can't see him because of the little Weathers Channel thing. Oh, no, now he's crawling. Okay, I don't know. All right, good job. Back there. to your dad. He's exactly. trying to see if there's food over there. B16 said, when I studied for my Series 7, I had to read out loud because I speed read and skip the small words, but those uh, and or ors make a difference when you're talking about the financial industry. Oh, yeah. <laughs> exactly. Oh, yeah. Um, And so I agree. Like, I was literally, and that's another problem. That's my biggest challenge mm -hmm. with my job. I love my job, mm -hmm. but when we first get a new project, the way that us as trainers, we, the way that we as trainers are supposed to get the, like extract information is by reading this like 20 page document. And then we're supposed to read that 20 page document. And, and then, then we're supposed to start making materials. Say, yeah. yeah. And that's what I struggle with the most is like, I'm just looking at the words, like I don't understand. And yeah, so you need to do an audible there. And that's what I'm reading. So I'll read out loud. Um, it, the purpose of this document is to outline the specifications needed to implement the project. Okay, okay got it. Like, but I'll literally just be no, reading yeah, that's out loud. How I am too. I'm, like, I'm a three three reader. Yeah. Like I go back and read it. Read it three, three times. times. Yeah, exactly. So reading like, out okay, loud helps okay. me. Yep. Yeah. Debbie's here. Says the morning all. Oh, yes, absolutely. Good morning, all. So yes. Um, Jen said, I'm waiting to be kidnapped by a van full of bears. What? Or bears. Ha <laughs> ha, I get it. I get it. Oh, I get it. There is a I van full it. of them. Well, I think they, <laughs> they need definitely, that. Exactly. I think, I think they, they definitely If it wasn't a van, it would have been a van. Uh, oh, shoot. Is it Dee's birthday? Am I missing something? Happy yeah, belated birthday. Yeah, happy birthday, Dee. Oh, I hear it here. Wrapping up birthday week. Oh, yeah. That's amazing. Ooh. Happy belated birthday. Exactly. So, You're amazing. Yeah, absolutely. Um, Sam Banner said, that's one way to hide a body. Yep. Dig a deep, 
cylindrical hole. As you fill the hole after dumping the body, stop an inch or so above the head and place a dead animal on it. There it is. There that way is. it throws the scent of the... There it is. Okay, and while you're doing this, you might as well lay down some foundation <laughs> and rebuild <laughs> the... Like, what the heck is going on? <laughs> Do you have 13 people out here What the heck is happening? You don't have that much time. Okay? Like, well, then, I mean, irrigation lines. I got to make sure the door is in the house. Like, that sounds way deep. Uh, I hate to tell you, but halfway through, you're going to bust it. You'll get busted. Right? You'll be sweating. Uh, it didn't work. Right? I didn't think, work. And then your sweat's going to, they're going to find your sweat That's in the leaves and the uh, dirt. Give yeah. it up. So. Just drive to the station. Yeah. Turn yourself in. This is what I did. So. It's better for everybody. That's yes. all I got to say. Better for everybody. Oh, my gosh. That's so funny. Um, <laughs> Brianna said, look out, Richard Autumn has a plan. No, nah, man, I ain't getting rid of you. But I'm just saying, I could. Uh, if excuse me. Excuse could. me. That's the one point. Yeah, I start leaving notes everywhere. Jen said, will do, Chris. Um, I told them uh, that you and Autumn and Richard motivate me to get to the gym because I like talking with you. I like talking with you, too. Yeah. I, love seeing, I love seeing friends at the know. gym. It's beautiful. So, it's a very beautiful thing. Yes. Um, Mary T said the Bears are wonderful hosts. Yes, they are. They took us for awesome Utah burgers, uh, an amazing hike. We were oh, there. Yeah. oh man, we didn't get to go on no hike, but we, oh, went, we went to, to the, the salt mine. Yeah, we I was just thinking Redmond. about the salt mines earlier today. We went to so. Redmond. That was the best uh, trip we've ever had. Hogan said, "No, Richard, fresh concrete foundation is the first place to look." That also <laughs> makes some sense. Like hmm, this wasn't here a have month you, ago. Have you building a straight up cylindrical six foot hole? Yeah. And then going all out and laying dirt and filling it and then going. Yeah. Oh, I'm tired and of it. And you gotta burn I'm them clothes. You gotta burn. See, people, I don't think people were like, you have to burn everything. Like because Man, you're doing a state over. Exactly. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. After the next state over. Then she threw then, the murder yeah, weapon yeah. in the dumpster of her own business. Yeah. Like then go no, to no, the no. next state over to that. And then yeah. dump everything. It, well, and see, here's the thing. The you have to think about what is the most completely yeah. random thing you could ever do. Like you literally, you almost literally have to like put like a state in a like in a bag and just pick one out. Like because any logic that you would go to, mm -hmm. that's the logic that the investigators would use. Look so it you. has to kind of be random. So, so yeah, it's crazy. And that so. was today on ID Discovery. Exactly. Uh, <laughs> destination. This is definitely gonna get flagged. Yes. Like this live is definitely gonna get flagged. So cute. Yeah. No. Um. But that's all that I wanted to talk about today. I got yeah. nothing. Um, we got a busy day today. We got a busy day today. Also, I got to get on taxes, right? Taxes are Yay. important. We got to start that. Um, but, you know, have a good day, everyone. We'll see you on Wednesday. On beautiful Wednesday. Yep. And we got to take care of little Alex. So we'll talk yeah. to you later. Bye. 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 Bye.